Hey everyone, Sunder here and I'm gonna explain you guys how you can actually remap your entire wooting keyboard. And this is actually for all the wooting keyboards out there. It's the same method, same software, all the same. So let's get straight into it. So once you are in Wootility, select a profile that you want to change or remap and go to the bottom of your screen and click on the remap tab. So in the remap tab, you pretty much have two methods of remapping your keys. And the first method is the quickest one. So simply press a square on the keyboard, which you want to change. So let's say the caps lock, we want to change that to the W. You simply press the W on your physical keyboard and voila, you've changed it. So let's say I want the W now to be um, the X. So let's click on the W, press X on the physical keyboard. Wow, it's so easy, damn. But now of course you have the situation. I have a 68G and I don't have any physical multimedia keys. How am I gonna bind those on my 68G? Well, very easy actually. You go to the all character tab over here and just drop down the extended characters and the special characters or either of one of those. So let's say we wanna change the caps lock to a play and pause button. Uh, simply drag the play and pause button over at the caps lock and let loose and voila. It is remapped. It's easy like that. And of course, if you want to remap more things, you can just simply drag them over as well. Also, just for regular characters, you can just drag them over and bam, bam, bam. It's really easy like that. If you can't find certain bindings, you can also go to the search box and let's say we want caps lock. We just simply press in caps and voila, you can see we have caps lock and we can just put it back again. Save the keyboard and now we actually have everything rebinded. As you can see, H is now my open cal calculator button. So if you press that, boom, we have a calculator. Very nice. But let's say right now you don't want to have anything binded on your left control. You simply press your right mouse button on the square and voila, it is unbound and it doesn't do anything anymore. And on the left side of the remap page, you also have some default profiles which you can choose from and that's pretty much it for the video hope you guys found this helpful and of course if you have any questions or feedback be sure to let it know in the comments below goodbye